Hey everybody, welcome back to D&D Fishing. From our last little episode, as we said, the ice really isn't cooperating. So in the meantime, what we're going to do is we're going to do some few tips just to get you prepared for the ice time. And if you're like me and Dean, we don't want to spend a lot of money. We like making our own stuff. And a lot of people say, well, how do you get your minnows out on the ice and keep them aerated and keep them lively? Because if you don't have a live minnow, no live minnow, chances are you're not going to get the active fish. So what we've done here is we've just MacGyvered something right here is a Bass Pro aerator, right? So what we've done, you look on the inside, we've actually taken the tube and we've come in through the side with a drill and we'll turn it on for you and we'll look on the inside and you can just see the bubbles going. That's going to keep your minnows lively. Three, four, six hours, it doesn't matter. And the water's not going to freeze up because the water's moving. So once again, this is just simply a plastic tub and if you lock it on, tight, you can carry this thing across the ice, it doesn't flip over, it stays in your hut, and the minnows stay lively. We've had this in the garage for almost two days, staying cool with the aeration. It takes 1D battery, and you can, you can take it with you. You can sit in the truck, rest nice on the ice, it won't freeze up because the water's moving. So once again, you don't got to spend a lot of money. If you want to catch fish, and you want to catch crappie, which we love crappie, Go ahead and MacGyver something like this. Get your minnows out there, keep them active, they'll be happy, you'll be happy, because you'll be keeping crappy. So once again, fish on.